If equipped, blind spot monitoring, or BSM, uses sensors located inside the taillights to let you know when other drivers enter your blind spot zones from the rear, front, or side. When you start the engine, the BSM warning light will shine in both outside mirrors to confirm activation. The BSM detection zone covers about one lane on either side of you. The zone starts at each outside mirror and extends back toward the rear. The system activates when your speed reaches about 6 miles per hour or 10 kilometers per hour. If an object enters the blind spot zone from either side of the vehicle, the BSM light will appear in the corresponding outside mirrors. A warning will also be issued if a driver comes up from behind and enters the rear detection zone, or if you use your turn signal in a direction and the system senses another driver in that detection zone. If the difference in speed between you and the other driver is greater than 10 to 15 miles per hour or 16 to 24 kilometers per hour, a warning will not be issued. To ensure system function, always keep the taillights clear of dirt, snow, and other debris. Do not block the area with foreign objects. Please keep in mind, your touchscreen may call this feature blind spot alert. The rear cross path feature, or RCP, can help you back out of parking spaces where your view of oncoming vehicles may be blocked. Proceed slowly and cautiously out of the parking space until the back of the vehicle is exposed. Once the RCP system has a clear view of the cross traffic, it will alert you of an oncoming vehicle. RCP monitors the rear detection zones for objects that are moving toward the sides of the vehicle at speeds between 1 and 22 miles per hour or 2 and 35 kilometers per hour. Keep in mind, in a parking lot, oncoming vehicles can be obscured by vehicles parked on either side. If the sensors are blocked by other structures or vehicles, the system will not be able to alert the driver. As always, use caution and avoid distractions when backing up. Trailer Merge Assist is a function of the BSM system that extends the blind spot zone while pulling a trailer. When a trailer's electric brake harness is connected to the vehicle, you'll see a menu in the instrument cluster display where you can select the trailer type. Remember that only conventional trailers are supported. Selecting gooseneck or fifth wheel will disable the BSM system until the trailer is disconnected, or you disable and re-enable BSM in the Uconnect system. Also, when trailer merge assist is activated, the rear cross path feature will be disabled. Automatic trailer detection has two modes to help you specify the length of your trailer. Max mode will default to the maximum blind spot zone of 39.5 feet or 12 meters, regardless of the trailer length. Auto mode uses the blind spot sensors, along with forward movement of the vehicle, to determine a trailer's presence and length. Once a trailer is detected, the system defaults to the maximum blind spot zone until you verify the length. To do this, you'll have to make a 90-degree turn. Within 30 seconds, the system will detect and display the trailer length category in the instrument cluster display. Trailer merge warning extends the blind spot zone to cover the trailer length plus a safety margin. If another vehicle is detected in the zone on either side, the BSM warning light in the corresponding outside mirror will light up and an audible alert chime will be heard. Remember, BSM and other safety features are only designed to assist the driver and are not a substitute for safe driving. Always check your mirrors, glance over your shoulder, and always use your turn signal before changing lanes. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.